Alhamdulillah, wa salatu wa salamu ala rasulillah, wa ashadu an la ilaha illa Allah, wahdahu la sharika lah. Wa ashadu anna muhammadan abduhu wa rasuluh. Allahumma salli wa sallim wa zid wa barik ala sayyidina muhammad, wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa azwajihi ummahati al-mu'minin, wa ala man ittaba'ahum bi ihsanin ila yawm al-deen. My dear respected brothers and sisters in Islam, we continue on with part five of the series, the present day people of Sodom and Gomorrah, brothers and sisters in Islam. And I really would like to go into the subject right away so that I can cover uh, the rest of part one. We, as we explained in the previous uh, uh, session, uh, that we divided the nine chapters into five and four, five and four. Uh, because of the similarities, the close similarities, or at least the portion of the story uh, deals with one uh, uh, section and the other deals with. Uh, basically, the, the, the five, the first five chapters, they deal uh, with the initial story and with the, some hints to how it ended. Uh, but the last, uh, the second part, which is uh, 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 the four chapters, uh, they deal with the uh, ending the destruction and how it all ended in some details, brothers and sisters in Islam. So we mentioned that in part one, we have Al-A'raf and Al-Anbiya, which is we covered last lecture. Uh, today, we want to cover Al-Shu'ara Wal-Naml, Al-Shu'ara Wal-Naml, Wal-Safat, three more. Al-Shu'ara Wal-Naml, Wal-Safat. Al-Shu'ara is chapter 26, uh, look into verses 160 until 175 brothers and sisters in Islam. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم كذبت قوم لوط المرسلين The people of Lut, the people of Sodom and Gomorrah, belied the messengers. Uh, imagine, Lut was the only messenger sent to them, by the way. But why the messengers? Because when you belie one messenger, you belie the entire messengers, the entire list of messengers, all of them, all of them, even those who did not even uh, uh, reach you, you belie them because uh, we believe in all the messengers and the prophets, brothers and sisters in Islam. I, I love this. I love this part. And, and this, this is a message to us. Dua, the people who call to virtues, the people who call to the truth. Look at this. إِذْ قَالَ لَهُمْ أَخُوهُمْ لُوطٌ أَلَا تَتَّقُونَ Their brethren, Lut. Like I said, Lut was not one of them. Lut was sent to them from another place. But yet, Allah is saying, your brother Lut, he cares for you. Wallahi, we care for those people. We want to help them out. Satan did his work on them. Let's, let's take them out. That's, and that should be the heart of a caller to Allah, provided that they are not going to get to you. Because some of us, sometimes we may go and engage and we're weak. We have some issue ourselves and they may hunt you. So instead of you helping them, they hunt you. So you got to be careful. Inni lakum rasulun ameen. I'm, I'm a trustworthy. I'm... I'm I'm, 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 I care. I'm, I'm honest in my call to you. I receive revelation. The Quran, brothers and sisters in Islam, is there. The revelation from Allah addressing the subject and other subjects until the day of judgment is the final revelation. فَاتَّقُوا اللَّهَ وَأَطِيعُونَ So fear Allah and obey me. وَمَا أَسْأَلُكُمْ عَلَيْهِ مِنْ أَجْرٍ إِنْ أَجْرِيَ إِلَّا عَلَى رَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ And I'm not asking you for a, a wage or, or anything. Allah will provide for me. Look at this. Look, look what is the sin they did. Because again, we get, we get those people to say, well, their sin was being out of woodlock. So man and man should marry because that's, that's, that's no, no, no. أَتَأْتُونَ الذُّكْرَانَ مِنَ الْعَالَمِينَ Are you going into the males and leaving? وَتَذَرُونَ مَا خَلَقَ لَكُمْ رَبُّكُمْ مِنْ أَزْوَاجِكُمْ بَلْ أَنْتُمْ قَوْمٌ عَادُونَ And you leave what Allah has created for you, spouses, the women, 
That's the natural way to fulfill this desire, the sexual desire. Brothers and sisters in Islam through marriage. Look, look at the reaction now. Look at the reaction again. And that's their agenda. And, 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 and I, I call upon those who are helping their campaigns and, and standing by them. That's what is going to happen to us. That is what is going to, we're going to receive this soon from them. And it, 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 it's, it's mounting to that. قَالُوا لَئِن لَّمْ تَنْتَهِ يَا لُوطُ لَتَكُونَنَّ مِنَ الْمُخْرَجِينَ They said, oh Lut, if you do not stop abhorring us, talking about us like this, we will expel you, we'll kick you out of our town. Look, look at the reaction now, brothers and sisters in Islam, and that's what you must have in your heart. And no one should question you regarding what you harbor in your heart. Lut said what? In reaction to them, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm compassionate with you, I'm, you know, no. قَالَ إِنِّي لِعَمَلِكُمْ مِنَ الْقَالِينَ I abhor, I detest what you're doing. That's in the heart, by the way, the act. But I'm still going to give you da'wah. I'm still calling you to the truth. But inside, because if you don't do that, your heart will absorb it. You need to understand this. Many Muslims don't understand how the fitna penetrates the heart. تُعْرَضُ الْفِتَنُ عَلَى الْقُلُوبِ كَعَرْضِ الْحَصِيرِ عَوْدًا 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 فَأَيُّمَا قَلْبٍ أُشْرِبُهَا لُكِتَ فِيهِ نُكْتَةً سَوْدًا So the, the fitna is exposed, is presented to the heart. Now, if the heart doesn't deflect it, the heart will become like a sponge, will absorb it. So you have to deflect it. That's the detest, that's the abhor. And by the way, this has nothing to do, this is not inciting harm or hate or anything. No. You still have to give them da'wah. You, uh, you still have to try to do something about it. If you're unable at all, then build a wall, like the, the, the people, the Sabbath breaker. Build a wall between you and them. You can't be with them. You can't stand in a, in a stage with them. In a, in a conference, you can't. You can't stand with those who condone them on a stage. You can't. Because you're tacitly approving their other agendas. Brothers and sisters, pay attention here. قَالَ إِنِّي لِعَمَلِكُمْ مِنَ الْقَالِينَ Look at this now. And I call upon the brothers. This is one of the ways to protect yourself from such uh, agenda. Dua. رَبِّ نَجِّنِي وَأَهْلِي مِمَّا يَعْمَلُونَ Oh Allah, save me and my family, Ya Rab. May Allah save the families of the Muslims, Ya Rab, from this, Ya Rab, Al-Alameen. Ya Rab, save me and save my family from their doing, Ya Rab. Ya Rab, Ya Rab, Ya Rab, نَجِّنَا يَا رَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ اللهم نَجِّنَا مِنْ هَذِي الْفِتْنَةِ يَا رَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ Ya Rab, Ya Rab, نَجِّنَا يَا رَبْ Allah answered this dua. فَنَجَّيْنَاهُ وَأَهْلَهُ أَجْمَعِينَ إِلَّا عَجُوزًا فِي الْغَابِرِينَ ثُمَّ دَمَّرْنَا الْآخَرِينَ So we save them and his family accept again. <laughs> One member of the family who stood in the middle. And that's unfortunately so-called uh, مُجَدِّدِينَ of the time. <laughs> The people who want to change, they have agenda for the Muslim Muslims in America in particular. They say, okay, don't 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 deny it, don't support it. <laughs> That's the position of the wife of Lut. Come on, man. Who are you to say that? ABC Quran wouldn't say something like that. Under any circumstance, especially if you're followed by masses. Come on. Please come back. Come back to the truth. وَأَمْطَرْنَا عَلَيْهِمْ مَطَرًا فَسَاءَ مَطَرُ الْمُنْدَرِينَ And we rained upon them uh, rocks. And how awful this is. إِنَّ فِي ذَلِكَ لَآيَةً وَمَا كَانَ أَكْثَرُهُمْ مُؤْمِنِينَ وَإِنَّ رَبَّكَ لَهُوَ الْعَزِيزُ الرَّحِيمُ In is very similar, brothers and sisters in Islam. Let's finish. Uh, the first section here, the first five chapters uh, in this part. Uh, Surah Al-Naml, chapter 27, uh, 54 to 58, four verses. Uh, very similar. 
ولوطا إذ قال لقومه أتأتون الفاحشة وأنتم تبصرون an addition here you, you, you commit lewdness, indecencies, wickedness while you know it's wrong أَإِنَّكُمْ لَتَأْتُونَ الرِّجَالَ شَهْوَةً مِّن دُونِ النِّسَاءِ بَلْ أَنْتُمْ قَوْمٌ تَجْهَلُونَ Again, you go into men and leave women. You're ignorant. Again, look at the description. If you compile the descriptions, the, the words which describe them, awful, awful, awful. How dare you? How dare you leave the revelation and compromise that? Again, we're not inciting hate or violence against anybody. But this is what you should have in your heart if you are a believer. Again, the same thing. فَمَا كَانَ جَوَابَ قَوْمِهِ إِلَّا أَنْ قَالُوا أَخْرِجُوا آلَ لُوطٍ مِّنْ قَرْيَتِكُمْ إِنَّهُمْ أُنَاسٌ يَتَطَهَّرُونَ Expel the family of Lut from your town. They are indeed people who are trying to be pure. Uh, the same ending, and the wife was destroyed. Uh, the last section here in, in, in this part, brothers and sisters in Islam, is Surat uh, As-Safat, uh, verses 37. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, Surat As-Safat is 37, chapter 37, 133. Uh, to 138 five verses only and indeed Lut was one of the messengers we saved him and his family entire family illa except illa except his wife then we destroyed the rest of them. And, and look at this, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is addressing the Arabs who received. And, and, and that's, you know, that Dead Sea, they say that Dead Sea is the sign that Allah left for humanity. Dead, dead. And indeed, you pass by them in your way to Jerusalem, uh, uh, to trade. Uh, and uh, at night, you see their runes, their uh, uh, remnants. Uh, this shouldn't uh, be an element of reflection. Uh, brothers and sisters in Islam, uh, from this particular uh, story we we conclude uh, this part and and part uh, uh, part four and five which address the first uh, section of uh, of the Qur Quranic scripture which address the story which is the five chapters uh, we conclude that the reason why Allah subhanahu wa taala sent them a messenger warned them before he uh, he punished them is they uh, disclose their sin. They call people to it. They campaign for it. And that's what's happening now, unfortunately. Their agenda is to change us completely. You gotta be like them. Otherwise, you will be expelled. And in the second uh, section of the story, which is the destruction, you're going to find out that they're actually going to attack individuals whom they desire and they don't want to give in. The angels, in this case, uh, uh, being uh, manifested in a human form, depicted in a human form. They have taken a human form. Uh, only brothers and sisters in Islam, those who have purity in their hearts, they will be saved. Those who detested the act, not the people, abhorred it. And that's what we need to do. Uh, standing in the middle, you will be destroyed. That's the wife. Uh, 
brothers and sisters in Islam, also the story tells you, the part of the story tells you that if the issue becoming overwhelming, meaning that you cannot stand in the face of it, then you have to leave. You have to leave because at the end, Allah commanded the angels to inform Lut and his family to leave. Because sooner or later, this will lead to the destruction of, of people who promote, propagate this particular sin and the entire community will be destroyed. That's what's going to happen. The entire community will be destroyed, brothers and sisters, uh, in Islam. Uh, with this, inshallah, we uh, concluded the first part, uh, the first uh, uh, five chapters which address the issue, which is really uh, uh, the part which deals with the initial uh, story and uh, and the interaction uh, uh, between uh, uh, Prophet Lut السلام, and the people uh, which was presented in five chapters Al-A'raf, Al-Anbiya, Al-Safat, Al-Shu'ara, Wal-Naml and uh, one more chapter I believe uh, Inshallah, in the next section, we're going to deal with part two, which is really the destruction. Uh, and that will uh, take us to chapter Hud 11, 14, Al-Hijr, Al-Ankabut, and Al-Qamar, uh, brothers and sisters in Islam. Uh, till the next episode, I leave you in the care of Allah. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.